continue the work that my brother William started. And yes, there will once again be a Sheridan in the White House. Think your FBI paper pushers are a match for Sheridan's assassins, Amos? I don't. Keep your opinions to yourself, General Carrington. As you know, we can't proceed with the investigation without proof. No one can stop me from conducting my own investigation, you hear me, Amos? Number 13 will soon no longer be a problem. Frank, it's Janet. I've just finished my rounds. Do you still need me in this area? Okay, I'll head back to HQ. Feels like today's gonna be a quiet one, huh? Did you see the water this morning? What's that? Hold on. I'll call you right back. Sir, can you hear me? Easy. Looks like a bullet wound. Can you move your legs? I can't remember a thing. Do you think you can make it to the truck? Huh? The helicopter. Can you hear me? I'll take you to the first aid station. Try to walk. Be careful! Damn it! Helen? It's Janet. I just picked up an injured man on Brighton Beach. He's got no idea and can't remember a thing. I need to bring him in for a CAT scan as soon as possible. An hour? Perfect, we're on our way. How are you feeling? Still no memory? I found this key in your pocket. Ever heard of Winslow Bank? Here. Who's that? Not a good time. Tell the Mongols we spotted the car. Get over here! He's alive but in bad shape! <laughs>
Please step up to the teller, sir. Mr. Roland? It's been such a long time. I assume you want to access your safe? May I have your key? <clears throat> right this way, please. As you can see, we've upgraded our security system. You can't be too careful in today's world, right? Hello, James. Mr. Roland would like to access his safe. Hello, Mr. Roland. It's still at the far end of the room. Call me when you're ready to come out. The timer. Carrington was right. They took the bait. That's the mother load right there. The 20 would kill to get their hands on those files. We'll incriminate all of them from number 20 to number 1. What do you plan on doing on that boat? Confidential, huh? Oh, I get it. Well, if it's another one of that girl's ideas, I'd watch her six. She's nothing but trouble. Go ahead, set the bomb. I've fallen into my own trap. Well, well. I don't get this security system. Now how do you lower the... Ah! Oh! Well, well.
alarm is driving me crazy. This robber... Oh my god! Steve Rowland, you are under arrest for the murder of William Sheridan. Amnesia, eh? Indeed, there is no better defense. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say, Bannon, will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to... What good's a lawyer when you can't remember a thing? <clears throat> In your deposition, you even added that you don't feel like a killer. How touching. But the law doesn't operate on feelings. Does it? It operates on evidence, which I have in spades. Emory, the snapshots, please. Look at this photograph. See the impact on the back of the head? Where did the bullet come from, in your opinion? That building there, see? Right in the line of sight. And who have we here? Well... Need I get a mirror? Or are you finally going to confess to the assassination of... Agent Scott, line one. So where's that file? You're not going to believe this, Colonel. Steve Rowland's military file is missing from the Pentagon. They're positive your man was killed in a mission down in Mexico over two years ago. Well, his widow's in for a surprise. But before we announce your resurrection, Captain Rowland, we're going to... What the hell's going on here? Hey! Don't move. I'll get you. 
you out of those cuffs. Great to see you again, Steve. Listen, Mongoose has found you. Meet me on the roof. And don't go using G-Men for target practice, okay? The girl from the bank.
just got undercover officers in Brooklyn. That's where the guy was transferred. Hurry, 110 Sterling Street. Seeing me again doesn't do anything for you, does it? I can't believe it. You really have lost your memory. Who are you? I'm Major Jones, first officer for General Carrington. Ring a bell? Carrington went missing three days ago. He was leading a parallel investigation into President Sheridan's assassination. He's the only one who can get you out of this mess. It's not safe here. Over the wall. Let's go. 